Alrighty, what is happening, everybody? This is your boy Reverith here, coming to you live again from my parents' space basement. Blah! Alrighty, I'm here with the Guild Nobility here, and we're going to be running some Scandia. And I'm just going to pull all the mobs and die instantly. And it'll be a lot of fun. It sounds like a normal day in the life of Nobility members. We're casting out for Except a, this time, let's try not case. to lose the video, and the recording, and the Maybe. audio, and all that. Well, that was that was uh someone else's fault. So uh, uh Drew, how are you liking this guild? It's pretty awesome. I just joined, everybody's friendly. It's a great atmosphere. That's good. That's good. Then... No, be honest, be honest. <laughs> yeah. Oh, we'll have to lie in front of video guys. Yeah. Okay, Alright, well, I pulled the first little group from the uh, left play. side, and then I'll run up the right. Okie dokie. I do this in little parts. Well, do you and uh, what? Well, do we have two pullers right now? No, I oh. have one. Nakano, you, you can pull? go pull yeah, if you want. Might as well pull duels. Yeah, yeah, get yeah. Faster. Get them. Because we have charms running, right? So I want to get started on those bosses right away. Yeah, I'll go right. Oh man, what if we spawned Vayu? Um, I'm sure Skip would not be very happy. Oh man, he'd cry. We don't have <laughs> until we get anything. The key and he's wondering why we are avoiding him 24/7. He will ignore us for five whole seconds. Uh, you know that's the long five seconds for Skip, dude. I don't know about you guys, but I'm pretty intimidated by that. Yeah, uh, you know uh, that's five seconds I could have spent with him. Mm-hmm. <laughs> oh man. All right, so let's talk about nobility a little bit, guys. Um. I am Eric, I'm the guild leader of this set guild, and these are my amazing little members. Um, I mean, well, you know, slaves, members, same thing. Um, basically, I work them to the bone until they level the guild up so I can have an extended storage called the warehouse. No, I'm just kidding. Um, basically, nobility has been something that, uh, been a guild name that I've started on many other MMOs. Um, just Fiesta t for one to mention. I know a lot of people out there uh, played Fiesta too. So that's one place I started this guild. Um, it's always been a guild where I find that I don't focus heavily on, you know, making a champion guild. I want to fill the guild with champion people. Um, not particularly strong people, but the people that do their best to be the best they can as human beings in the game now i mean with most mmos you're always going to come across trolls you're always going to come across people that you know seem hot-headed and stuff like that and we all do as human beings that's just what you know that's in us um but i want to collect all the people that do their best to be the best person they can at all times and that's what I found nobility on and always seems to work because when I do that in turn it builds you know strong bonds between everyone that I invite into the guild and that seems to uh, extend the life of this guild and in turn like we just become a really really strong guild and that's always great that's always what that's not something I'm gonna like you know veer away from um, I wouldn't mind being a strong and top guild, uh, just as long as we keep to the notion that we are here to play a game and... I just died. Um, yeah, they're and... coming. <laughs> um, and here yeah, we go. Just... Yeah, here's the here's a wave. We threw out the pariah net and we got a bunch of bunnies. Oh yeah, we got a lot of bunnies. Uh, yeah, lots, a good catch. lots of bunnies. I got most of them on the right and all the way to the boss. Yeah, nice, I nice. noticed that. I was like running all these places. I'm like, well, this is a derp. I hope people enjoy watching it or listen to Eric talk. Oh, you know, this is a this is a thing. Yeah. Oh man, this isn't even all of them. Wait, was that this it? Or there no, more? they're <laughs> coming. Oh, there's more. All right. There's always more. Yeah, I think the ones that I pulled went to Pariah after I died. They did. They actually did. I was like, hmm. I don't think I can escape this one, guys. <laughs> they got me! <laughs> if you build it, they will come. Oh, man. These bunnies. I mean... They're, they're cute, but they hurt. It's okay, guys. I got meteors. 
It's right, fine. I'm good. just spamming AOE heal. Because I uh, just... The hots so wouldn't do it? anything because Nakano's just gone. Nah, they're nope. still stragglers. And give it another 20 seconds. Are we going to, are we going to, like, is this the rest of the bunnies on the map, though, after this pull? I believe so. There I might be some on the far everything. left. Okay. There might be some on right, the well, very I mean, far left. I didn't go out there. Stragglers are all right. Stragglers all right, are all right. Well. So. I'm going to go find them. That's okay. We'll, we'll start you're, Yeah, you're I didn't go to the far left. Wait, there's all wrong. these guys over Wait, there's here. there's more. There's more. Just do my job. Distance primary until the DPS dies. <clears throat> Which will probably be me. I think Whoa, that's it. Right. Speaking well, of West Stryker, I got I got a group, guys. I have a group. I didn't go to the far left. I went uh, like halfway. Right. Yeah. There is small. Let's just wait a little bit then. An invitation nah. to all Ravagers to come join the guild because we have three out of eighty. Like yeah. I'd like some yeah. fellow axe friends, please. Also some Thanks. guardian. It would not be, it would not be bad. I mean, it would rely heavily on the few guardians that are here right now, um, which is really bad because you know you need guardians oh. for higher level dungeons. There There's no way you can do it without them at the moment. I'd like to drop a shout out to Bai and Master Mon for getting me to 54 because I've been partying with those tanks forever. Uh, Good. Well, didn't yeah, didn't that one that guy? Like yeah, didn't he like not he DC'd and like DC or whatever and he, like left us. I seem to yeah, remember that. Thing. Yeah, that guy. We love yeah, him, but we hate him. But uh, we love him. Right. And I'm sure there's much to be said about people who don't play the game, but are interested. Wait, wait, wait what? What does that mean? Alright, so you guys, if you like MMOs and you're casual, then you're going to love this game because, you know, you can easily rush through the content, but then it kind of stops, you know, it's like, what, five days into open beta or something now? Almost yeah. a week? And, um, you know, yeah, you, you can soar right through it. Um, oh, for sure. But, you know, it's like 1 through 50 is a tutorial, then everything gets fun. And Nakano, are you going to hot or am I going to hot? Uh, just let me do the healing. You do damage. Oh, shoot. Okay. My healing, my heals are stronger than yours. The uh, make me oh. feel inferior. Likes a lot. I'm sorry. There. GG. I'm sorry. I'm just higher level than you. What, what can you do about it? <laughs> report you as for harassment. As, uh, as far as this game goes, I mean, it, it is really, really easy. It's really like beginner friendly to people that are new to MMOs, just because when you follow the storyline. You just level, and that's just how it goes. Yeah. Um, I mean. But how many so of us actually people. know the storyline? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> true uh, that. But I mean, if well, I mean, do... everybody wants to be part of the first day rush, right? Yeah, exactly. Um, I know if I start another character, I'll definitely pay attention to the storyline. It oh, seems dude. interesting just from like the glimpses I've caught of this actual story. So if you guys, you know, you guys out there. Um, if you guys ever watch Sword Art Online, this game is, you know, was such a big hype because it was focused on being, you know, similar to that in the case of like the Sky Tower and such, which is not yet implemented. But when it does, but you could be Kirito as long as you spell your name completely differently. Yeah, exactly. It's also friendly to people who don't really watch anime. I'm myself am in that category, but I enjoy the, j the game just the same. Yeah, and it's completely free to play, and it's far from pay to win. So you know, it's yeah, I mean, it's all right. You know, it's yeah. definitely a more social based game than anything. You know, we got the guild here. There's no like guild PVP or nothing like that, which is really lame yeah. in my opinion. This is not just yet, about it yet. for yeah. dungeons, oh, just running around and just talking and making YouTube videos to advertise to the guild. But you know what? Hopefully, in the future, they will have more guild based content outside of guild hall and spawning Eodolins, which are those things following us around and whatnot. Uh, well, it's a nice yeah. legend game nonetheless. Yeah, it so is. Gotta uh, keep in mind that it's going to be very similar to the previous X legend games like Grand Fantasia and Eden Eternal. Um, in which case, we're going to be seeing hopefully a couple system and some more guild oriented content for sure. I know that Sky Tower is going to be pretty heavily you know, leaning towards some kind of teamwork, right? You're not going to run in there with no teamwork at all. You're just going to get your, you know your butt kicked for sure in Sky Tower. It's apparently really hard. So, oh, and also, not to mention, um, in my 
guild command list, I do have a go to war button that teases me every day. I heard that on the Taiwanese servers that they haven't even completed the Sky Tower yet. They haven't? I think they were only like level, what, 30 or something like that? I think it's 100 floors, so. Yeah, so I'm interested to see how this game grows and evolves in time. Oh, yeah. It'll be interesting. And definitely the best best part of this game is that, you know, with a lot of games coming out nowadays, especially Aria games, nothing to bash on Aria or anything. They are a company, but uh, you do have to keep in mind that there are they are trying to here to make the money. But this game is definitely far from pay to win as of right now. Um, in the cash shop, really, there's only like little fortune bags that you might get a key from for Eidolons, uh, Eidolons being pets. Um, but the chances of getting one are really low. I mean, I've gone through like 50 bags already and I haven't gotten one fragment. So, really low chance on them. You're better better off just farming them mm. through Guild Hall or through the temple. That's that's actually better and faster and doesn't cost as much. Uh, as Do you feel buyer's remorse? Goes. <laughs> Do you f uh, no. <laughs> I mean, I don't mind spending. It's kind of fun, you know. Spend yeah, I feel like... When you spend money, you're contributing to the company of the game. Mm -hmm. And and that's yeah. one of the big points of it. Um, but, you know, some people are just like, really? I just spent all that and I got a small bead to increase this or whatever. You know, something that's not really that useful as of right now. Um, you know, so sometimes it's kind of like, oh my gosh. But hopefully we're going to get tiered spenders and all kinds of fun that stuff in the really future. Oh, hey guys, we have an idol on. We have a spawn. Popping a charm. Uh, well, we still got nine minutes on ours. At least mine. What, where is this thing? I got four minutes on my uh, loot. We should probably kill the last boss first, cause it's like all the way back. Nah, let's just let's just kill it. In case we get another Eidolon, we can get another Eidolon off the last boss. Really? That's confirmed. Oh, uh, yeah. Pretty sure. I'm pretty sure I had. An yeah, Eidolon. that's happened. Yeah. Nice. Oh, all right, Tigerius. This is a very interesting Eidolon. Last name the is Tiger Caesar. of Thunder. Forget that. Um, he's very interesting just because of the fact that you can ride him as a mount, which is really cool, but he's really hard to fight against, especially in Eidolon Temple, just due to the DOT. Unless you're a bard, let's just tear through everything. Yeah, that's the hmm. thing. If you're starting this game, and you want to take it easy and not have to worry about dying or anything like that, go Bard. Yeah, Bard, it's uh, one of the, right now, especially in the beginning, it's just like, you don't even need gear. I mean, you just kind of just use your hots, ballad, and you're done. You know, that's yeah. all it is. Until we it's get a very the... healing-based class. Mm -hmm. oh, sure. And that's the one I'm playing right now, but I'm not healing because Nakano, he's, he's just too high of a level and my heals uh my hots anyway that's like aoe party buff kind of thing uh they it'd just be a waste of a skill to use um there's no point in doing it we should take a minute and talk about the class and the subclass system well, okay if you've ever played etri and odyssey it's that <sighs> yeah basically i mean you really honestly it's an interesting thing that x legend did basically you have one main class that you basically oh i got a fragment um, I got two it. fragments. I got three yes. fragments. Wow. Anyways, as I was saying, like it's very simple in the fact that if you played MMOs before, uh, if you just get one main class, um, and then when you get to oh I'm I go oh, I'm getting lost. Um, when you get to level forty or so, you will unlock another class. Uh, it's your subclass, and you will get to your offhand weapon will now become that. And what that allows you to do is use the skills, the first skills of that class, that subclass, in addition to your main class. So you want to find something that will complement your uh, main class uh, more so than, you know, anything else. I know we have Qatar coming up. Uh, that's supposed to be content that will be released soon. It is not yet released. As of right now, the only classes right now are what Guardian, which is the tank at the moment, Ravager, which is type of the gladiator slash, you know, typical Ravager, really. Um, we got 
like DPS, like Duelist um, and Gunslinger, which is Gunslingers are ranged, so is Grenadier. They're all ranged classes with high DPS. Um, who what else am I missing here? We got Bard, we got Sorcerer, uh, kind of like so Wizard, you know, all these magic classes. Bard is the only class that can group heal and really is the support main support class, though I know that uh, Sorcerer does have a healing totem, does it not? That would be Grandiers. No, it's a oh, sleep no, totem. Grand. Right, right, right. My bad. Um, but, I mean, as far as the game goes, uh, don't worry too much about your subclass until you hit uh, higher levels. That way, when you're going through 1 to 40, just watch other classes and see what it is that you like. And pick, and then pick something that will complement the main class that will fit your play style. That's the main thing. And of course, there's something really interesting about this game being the Envoy Path. That's a that's a really neat neat system. So if you guys get a chance, go look up Aria Games, and they have it on their website. Everything that has to do with the Envoy Path, and you can take a look at that system there. Um, well, we just finished this dungeon here, right? Right. Yeah. Maybe. Yeah. 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 We finished this dungeon, which is pretty good. It was a good, good run. No one Only died. one Eidolon, though. Well, hey, it's hey, better than no Eidolon. That's true. It's better than none. You okay. guys want to run a dungeon on Hell mode? Because there's still time. Or. Alrighty. Well, anyway, let's wrap this up, guys. It's been a great time running you through Scandia, getting you to hear some uh, uh, just the guild members here. We've got uh, Eric, the guild leader, Nanaka, Azusa, er, Eddie, you know, seriously, uh, Drew, PK, and Athene, and myself. So uh, catch you guys later, and hopefully we'll see you in game. We're on the server Siren, and our raid call will be in the description. So you guys take care and have a good one.